So guys, out in the local farmer's field here, we're looking at corn, which right now is at V4 growth stage, approaching V5 probably within the next few days. Uh, we're just taking a look as to the stand, making stand counts probably, see what his population turns out to be. Again, this is uh, where we come out and assess things for, crop, for the farmers to see what we need to add. And this is a good time if he's going over to spray it with a fungicide or any other herbicide even, is to put in some AgriSweet, which is an energy source, uh, use our Drivus, which is a driver, and even remember adding liquid carbon, a humic. Your soil constantly needs humics in it to release the nutrients that you have in there that's tied up. So we usually come out and assess it, and if, if you happen to be tissue sampling, then many times you should tissue sample as well as, as taking the sample and maybe you want to pull a soil sample at the very same time and I would pull it very close to where you're taking the tissue sample that way the plants telling you what's in it and you can discover what's still in the soil and compare the two am I getting nutrients into the plant that I do have in the soil or or I don't have them in the soil therefore it's not showing up in the plant so this is a good way to judge for yourself what's happening out into your cornfield or soybean field or whatever crop that you're growing. So again, and, and sometimes we even like to dig up a plant just to see what's going on in the soil. You really need a bigger shovel than I got. But, and I did break off some roots getting this up. But even in this case, we see the root mass is, is growing very way it's supposed to at 35 degree angles therefore it's not showing up compaction and that's what we want so we want a lot of these root hairs to show up that root hairs is what's taking in the nutrients and the moisture and the water so as you can tell even by the color of the crop it is in a pretty healthy state right now so then when we do t t uh, count there is one two three four this one is five growth stage five v5 because the collar is now completely open this one has yet to open so that's going to be six seven eight nine when it finally opens so this is how you judge your growth stage and then you can go online with some of the apps to find out uh, growing degree units and days because that's also what makes up the yield factor in your crop so I hope this was a valuable lesson to talk about today. Hope you have a great growing season. Thanks.